Hey everyone, so welcome back to my channel. So I did decide that I'm not gonna vlog this weekend because I feel like I'm really not doing anything. Like it would have been the exact same as the other vlogs that I put up. So instead I'm gonna do a big haul. So I have my big, big ass pile of clothes here. Um, oh shit, what was that? Um, yeah, so I bought these last week and, no, last week and just week before. So there's a Oh Polly Bowen tea set. I got some loungewear from Missy Empire and then two bits from Birch Gap. But first, I did get my new Yeezys this week. So I'm gonna show you those first. I'm gonna try them all on and then sit down and give you my little review on each one of them. And then I'll obviously link them all down below. But yeah, first I got my Yeezys. So I got them off StockX. I've put it on my Instagram a few times. That, that's where I've got my other two pairs from. Um, so I got the 350 Cinder. So, for anyone that doesn't know, they're like not actually black. Like if you, sh if I, oh. so yeah, I'm gonna show you like a black top beside them. They're like a greyish charcoal black. Like I don't know if charcoal is the right word. Do you know what I mean? Like it's like a greyish black. But um, they were three hundred and sixty euro, including shipping, VAT, and I think that just covers if they get lost with StockX. Like that's you pay about seventy euro for all that. But I know it includes all that um, good important stuff. But yeah, I was really happy with the price of them because most 350s that come in black, even though these are like not actually like a deep black, but they're still black to me. So, but yeah, most of them are resold from like 800 euro to 1,400 euro, like literally. They're so rare, so they go for so much. So I was just so happy to actually get a pair that are any type of black and I'm just like over the moon with them. So I got a UK 4 in these ones. So my other 350s, let me just double check. Yeah, a UK 4. My other 350s are UK three and a half, but I went up half a size because they are extremely tight. Like the quality of them are literally unreal, but the stitching is so, so tight on the front. So they kind of like crush your toes. And um, so that's why I went up half a size. And then for anyone just like for size reference, by the way, I'm usually a UK three, like true to size, always a UK three. So I definitely size up if you're gonna get them. And then with my 500, I like had an absolute brain fart when I was ordering them and accidentally ordered a US men's five, which means that they're four and a half, UK four and a half. So I have a pair that are three and a half, a four, and then four and a half. But um, yeah, I now know that the UK four is definitely what fits me best because my other 350s are just a bit tight and then my 500s are just a bit loose. So hope that helps someone, but onto the clothes now. I'm gonna just start with the loungewear from Missy Empire first. As I said, I just wanted like a few bits of loungewear. I feel like I either have loads of like PJs or like really dressy clothes, but I didn't really have like just cute little sets to wear if I'm not really doing much, but just like, you know, going out about or just chilling with James. Just wanted like, I don't know, nice bits. I feel like once you feel nice and stuff you wear, you're just in a better mood anyway. So yeah, first I'll show you what I got from SC Empire. First thing I got was this black cohort. Actually, do you know what? I'm just gonna put these on. Right, so the first thing I got is this black cohort. So it's just a crop top and flare trousers. So yeah, I'll just try to show you a better angle. So it's just ribs. They're not see-through. Like they kind of look like they could be, but I don't think they are. Um, so yeah, that's that. I just can't really show you the flared part, but they're nice long black flares. And it's just casual. Yeah, so the trousers were 16 and the top was 12. So I think a bit of a bargain. Like it's just a two-piece, nice and comfy, and I'm really happy with it. Um, sizing. I'd say the trousers are quite long, so I just cut the end of them because I do that all the time. Sometimes I make a balls away, other times I'm grand. Um, so yeah, I think they are both true to size, but obviously if you've got bigger boobs, I definitely size up in the top because I've got like nothing and like they're ba barely just like covering it. So that'd be my only advice on that one. But next, um, I'll just show you these track spots that I got. I'll try them on now. But again, Missy Empire, how much are these and what size do I get? Yeah, so I got a size six and they were 22 euro. Um, so I'll try them on now. So this is the track spot was on. Um, they're just loose and baggy. I'm trying to, I have to show you this in two halves because I can't really show you the bottom, but they are really nice. Um, I just can't show you this, but yeah, they're just cuffed at the end. They fit really nice. I'm really sure. And I find like the cuffs are grand. They're not too long. They are so comfy. Like they're baggy, but I just absolutely love them about quite difficult to show on camera because I can't get my legs in it like I just need to get a better set up but anyway I'm absolutely obsessed with this cohort so I never really get colours and I was a bit adventurous and got a purple two-piece and a pink two-piece um but this is the jumper 
absolutely love and then there's just these cute little knitted shorts again just for like being around the house in love them so i'll put it on now this is the pink cord i absolutely love it like i just love the shorts i love little knitted shorts um yeah i think it's really nice i got a small and it comes with a small medium large and this was 24 euro but yeah i never like pink but i just really really like it Okay, so this is the last thing that I got from Missy Empire, but oh my god, 100% my fave. I'm absolutely obsessed with purple recently. So I got this purple little knitted cardigan and bicycle shorts. They're like a slightly different shade, but I feel like you get away with it. But yeah, it's just, I just think it's so cute. I'm absolutely obsessed with this cardigan. I like that it's just like hanging and it's just tied in the middle. But I can't remember how much either of them were. I feel like the bicycle shorts were like tenner. Could be wrong, but I will link them down below. And I got a six in both. But yeah, I'm just like, I'm obsessed with this one. I'm going to wear it forever and ever. I feel like a purple Power Ranger. No, there is no purple Power Ranger, but I'm taking it upon myself. But I am the new purple Power Ranger. Power Ranger system. That's all I got from Missy Empire. And then I got this um, gym set from Bow and Tea. I went with the new, it's like a beigey nude, I guess. I don't know what it's called on the website. What is it? Um called sand i got the leggings in the petite because then they like fit my legs perfectly and i got an extra small and then i got the top in an extra small as well and i'm obsessed with this top i'll try it on now anyway but it's the one that like wraps around your neck Let's see i'll put this on now okay so this is the set on um again trying to show you my ankles but i can't really so the petite leggings just got literally to my ankle and i have such short legs but i do really really like it I'm absolutely obsessed with like anything that comes in nude. I just, it's my favorite color ever. Um, I don't know whether I'm like crazy, crazy about this gym set because I'm like, will I actually want to wear this to the gym even though it kind of looks like it's skin color. So I don't really know. Don't you buy clothes, you're not really realistic about it. So yeah, the only thing is I'm like, would I wear this walk around fly fit? I don't know yet, but I do love it. I feel like you can kind of make it like a little two piece as well. If you had a cute jacket on, I could definitely wear it with, like my beige easy. So I kind of like that look, but yeah that's that better look at it i think um but yeah the last little set is this cream little knit top and blue flared jeans i'll show you it's better in a second but it's just like this the top i got in a size extra small i think it was like 10 euro it's from bershka and so are the jeans but i got them in a six but um i'll show you now I can't really show you, but the jeans have a little split up the flare and i don't know i get like 70s vibes like, I really, really like them. You can kind of see my belly button. But I like that you can. I don't know. I'm just feeling this outfit a lot. Like, absolutely obsessed with it. I'll try to show you the flare in the jeans a bit better. But ignore my toes too, jeez. But, um, yeah. No. That's the jeans and the flare. So, yeah. The, this has to be... Oh, I know. I said it's something else is my favourite. But I think it's this. These were, like, 25 99 I think. But, again... I'll leave a link below in the description. But yeah, that's actually all I got. So I don't know if I have anything else really to tell you. Um, yeah, I just kind of thought this video would be better than the last few vlogs that I've been doing and it just would have been like the same shit. But I don't know if th this really went how I wanted it either. I have my ring light. I just forgot the thing that holds your phone in it. So it's like, it can be a tripod. So basically I have the light, but I just couldn't put my phone on it, which kind of ruined it for me because I wanted to put my phone in it and put it up high. But again, it's just Jade and her disasters on this YouTube channel. But anyway, <laughs> yeah, even though I'm not vlogging, uh, I suppose I can tell you what I'm doing. So I'm going to drink with my friends tonight. Tomorrow is Sunday. I'll spend it with James. Then I have my course again on Monday. Then just work for the week. That's literally it. Get my workouts in. I haven't been able to work out as much as I was during lockdown at all. Like I'm literally working out three or four times a week and I was doing like five to six days before that. Um, so that's kind of bothering me, but I'm just going with the flow. I'm just like putting like 150% into the workouts that I can get done on those days. And I've actually made myself a program. So I've been, I'm on week three of my muscle mass program and I've been finding my training a lot harder because I'm really like focusing on rest times and I'm not taking over a minute between each set and I like really emphasize that I probably was taking way longer in between sets beforehand. Um, but yeah, that's just a bit of a what I'm doing on that. 
because uh, I feel like I haven't posted any workouts on Instagram, but I don't know, like, there's just so much shit and negative things going on in the world right now, and sometimes I get in the mood where I'm like, Instagram isn't really what I should be using, and then I get carried away in work, and I kind of just, like, forget, but yeah, I'd absolutely love to know what you would want to see more of on my channel, like, if you could comment, I'd appreciate it so, so much, and um, just, like, ideas of what you want to see more of, because I'm not really sure what else to do, or, like, if I have ideas, I'm just struggling with time, but yeah, let me know what you want to see. Like, there is a video coming with James, a Q&A, we're just waiting to do it, really. Um, but that already is an idea, so videos with James are already an idea, so... Things other than, like, a vlog and including James. Also, I'm also waiting on um, books from Book Depository, but... Yeah, I ordered three, but they haven't come yet. I was hoping that they'd come so I could put it in this. I thought they'd arrive this morning. Also waiting on leggings from Amazon, but I'm going to do a whole YouTube video on those by themselves because uh, they're supposed to be dupes of Lululemon. So stay tuned for that one. Thanks for watching if you made it this far. Actually, also, I just wanted to say a huge thanks to all the girls that follow me on Instagram. You know who you are or text me or comment on my pictures. I like feel overwhelmed with love this week. And like, it's just mad, like, because even when I'm doing this video, I'm a bit like, oh, that didn't go how I wanted it to go. I'm not really happy with it, but girls are just so, so nice. Like, I know, I feel like we all talk about how mean girls can be and how bitchy they can be, but also there's just like absolute angels out there that are just so, so nice to me. So yeah, thanks so much for the love as always. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.